Representative Christensen is one of the lawmakers up for re-election this year. And like many, he's already filed, but the deadline to file is Friday, by the way. This is your reminder. Tomorrow is a pretty important deadline for those not running for office, too, but those who want to vote in the May primary. If you plan to vote for the Republican ticket, you have one more day to make sure you are registered as one. Unless, of course, you haven't registered at all, then you can register now or you can register day of, which would be May 17th. Or if you plan to vote in the Democratic primary, you don't really have to do anything yet either. But if you are registered Democrat and you want to switch sides for the primary, then that deadline applies to you, which is tomorrow, because Idaho Republicans have a closed primary election. If you are registered as a Republican on primary election day, you'll get a Republican ballot. If not, you can register on election day with a Democratic Party or choose to vote unaffiliated, meaning your ballot will only have a few options on there for nonpartisan positions like judges. But you will not be able to change your affiliation at the polls, so keep that in mind. And once the primary is over, it won't matter anyway what your registration is because we're all going to get the same general election ballot. However, there could be another wrinkle to Idaho's Sharpay election rules. There's a bill in the legislature right now that would require all voters to affiliate by tomorrow. It's already passed the House, and it is an emergency clause attached to it, meaning if it passes the Senate and signed by the governor, it would go into effect immediately. But how that would affect Friday's deadline, obviously it would be too late, so who knows? We do know, though, you can register to vote, or you can change your affiliation right now online at voteidaho.gov.